know. What? I'm terrible at the you, end you, you have some, uh, no, you're doing some black magic or something? Yeah. I, you're getting sleep. See? You know? You are getting that was black magic from from that position. I was surprised. Man, black magic. No more black magic. What are you talking about? <laughs> Telling you, this guy is so sneaky. How did that happen? This guy is so sneaky. I <laughs> This guy is so sneaky that we you, you have to kill him with it. some kind of uh, move. Wow! Look at this, huh? Hey. Look at this. So, what are you proposing, my friend? What are you trying to propose now? Okay? I don't know what he wants to do now. You know? So, but you gotta be careful. Always sneaky. <laughs> All of a sudden he finds a crazy uh, move, you know? See? I don't move! I'm afraid. <laughs> See, I'm telling you, this guy is the sneakiest guy of all time. <laughs> Who is the greatest chess player? You're talking about me? Yeah. All right. You know? Colorado. Sir? This guy is always trying to sneaky guy. 
You didn't say you wanted to trade. Oh, you have to I say, say that. I have to say you that. Have okay. To say now I want to trade with you, sir. You have to say. <laughs> <laughs> Sneaky guy. <laughs> it's okay. The sneakiest of them all. You gotta be careful with him. See, I knew that he was gonna do that. This guy is always uh, trying to do something that's not allowed. Huh? The guy is always trying something sneaky all the time. Sir, what are you trying to do now, sir? Trying to survive. Trying to survive? Trying to survive. Really? <clears throat> yeah. You can't be doing that, sir. I know. Right? How about I go here? See? I'm telling you. I can't do anything, sir. You know what? Let me change it a little bit. Let's change a little bit. You know? Wow. See that? You see that move from this guy? I have to defend, sir. You know? Because you're trying to look at this. This guy is too much. This guy is too much. Man. Shoot, look at this. I'm defending. You know, I'm not so Man, you are scary, Jeff. You're scary. Oh, look at this, sir. Okay? Go there first. Before anything else. Man, Woo! scary proposition. <laughs> Jeff, 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 look at that. <laughs> look at that, Jeff. <laughs> Time is of the essence. Look at this guy, man. Oh, see that? See that, sir? See that, sir? Shoot. What the heck? What the heck? Now. He doesn't know what to do.
Good game, boss. That deserves it. Good game. Good game, man. Good game. Not good ones, that was, but that was good. Yeah. I don't know why I played, I oh, why I played Bishop <laughs> Henry there. I don't like. I, I, you were yeah. Chest it. blindness. You were to flag him, I think. Chest no, blindness. No, no, what happened is yeah. I, I. Remember, you were getting sleepy. Uh, okay. <laughs> That's why I gave all those speeches. You know? Hey guys, Brent here. What a great positional battle between these two, and it all came down to this position in the game. And this is where Black's biggest advantage was, and uh, he moved. Rook d3 and Jeff's come up with a beautiful plan. Get the check and the lateral move. And I think here in this position, uh, Ray thought that this bishop was protected after trying to tempo this queen or trap it, but alas, not there. And figured he could win on time, but Jeff was super, super clutch here. What I think he had one second left to finish off, right? And just uh, absolutely amazing, man. Beast mode, that's why he is a shark. Definitely use some black magic there. <laughs> very, very nicely done, Jeff. That is not easy to do under time pressure against a great player like Stingray. So kudos to, to Jeff for that, man. I'm telling you, the guy is really, really good. And I think in this position, like I told you, it's the inflection point, right? And then Jeff busted out his fancy stuff. How can Black kind of keep his advantage here? There was nothing tactically missed in this game. It was very, very super positional and kind of grinding, right? So... What would you play here as black? Yes, maybe this knight's not doing anything. So maybe just re reroute after, oops, sorry, instead of that, knight b7. And maybe rook here to unveil an attack on on the knight. But uh, to protect, this could be one continuation. And I'm not saying that white would play that, but... Uh, Black is winning here at negative 5.5. So that was it, man. That's how you know it's a good, great game between two good players when it all comes down to that one position and just back-to-back -back opportunities on both sides. And it's a great flurry and finish there at the end, man. I I, th I feel like if you're in Black's position here, it's something, just sacking or something. But even that's hard to do because, look, this pin that Jeff had, that was a monster pin, right? Just kind of held the position together and... That bishop was absolutely clutch there with the corner mate there at the end. So, wow, beautifully done, Jeff. Great fight, Stingray. These guys are good, man. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know if you thought the game in the comments below. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. With that pump kitchen. Thanks. See you guys tomorrow.